and switch gears and toss it over to Elisa with a check of the forecast. Good morning. Good morning to you. We're looking at some ground clutter right around our radar site. Power 5, though, picking up some rain well down to our south. I don't think it's going to be an issue for most of us. However, during the afternoon hours, we'll probably pick up a little bit of shower activity. Let's go right to our big board weather maps because we do want to talk about all these things going on. We've got clouds, we've got cool temperatures, and speaking of these uh, temperatures, these are about uh, the warmest temperatures we're going to see today. Right now, Hopkins is at 67, Medina 65, Worcester at 64, 65 in Jefferson, the Science Center with a temperature of 70. We've got a lot of cloud cover out there and that's going to keep things pretty settled. We're going to take you through the day. About noontime, a couple of isolated showers popping up. Nothing all that widespread and nothing all that heavy. I don't think we're going to see anything in the way of severe weather. Just a couple of hit and miss. About 5 o'clock, very few showers, but a couple out there. The cloud cover, that is going to persist throughout the day. A pretty good blanket of clouds for today as well as tonight and getting into early tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning, a couple of showers off to our west. A few of us will see them, some down to the south during the day on Tuesday. This taking us through tomorrow afternoon. Again, a fair amount of cloud cover. We're also tracking the remnants of late. Now a tropical depression still bringing a great deal of rain and strong winds to portions of the southern United States. Interesting thing with Lee, it is continuing to track on up to the north and I think perhaps by Thursday we will start to see the remnants of Lee. The other system that we're tracking is Katia. Very strong storm now. It's a Category 2 hurricane out in the Atlantic. High sustained winds within the system, 105 miles per hour, and those are the sustained winds. A pretty strong core there. So as we watch Katia, that's going to be a system we're going to have to keep our eye on for the next several days. Your hour-by-hour -hour forecast keeps us in the 60s throughout the day. Some rain right around around noon and around 3 p.m. Again, the forecast for today, a high only in the 60s, mostly cloudy, a few showers, northerly winds. That's going to be an interesting thing to watch today. The winds, they're going to be strong. As a result, a small craft advisory is posted for Lake Erie. Then for later on tonight, we're going to look at cloudy conditions. I need to take out those rumbles of lightning. I don't think that's going to be a problem for tonight. Cool for tonight, a low of about 54. Again, the wind's going to be something of the story today a northerly wind that's going to be pretty strong. A few showers tomorrow morning, the remnants of Lee coming through on Thursday. Temperatures do start to build up in that UV index for today, only a three. Well, so to come, the tribe is about to take